This one will put on the center line on your left. Just put it out. You're so fast, right? Yeah. Okay, uh -oh. but it's alright. So then, if you are very, your hand sticky, just put in the water. And this, the towel, is to control your wetness. Okay. So now, we are going to transfer the rice from left to right. Now, don't be worried, I will go to that corner, okay? Everyone will be fine. Okay, please spread the rice. Not a lot of rice. Should it be very less? Less rice, so you taste more ingredients. More rice, you don't taste so much. Okay, yes, to the end, straight to the end, and then you are going to spread the rice up to the left. The wasabi and then transfer wasabi into this and then spread on the top of the well just lightly don't put a lot yes okay so now ready in the middle cucumber above the wasabi press it down <laughs> Ready? Here, I am going to lift it up and then to the end of the rice that you want.
Welcome everyone, welcome to worldice.com. My name is Hector, filling in for Jay for the latest Street Scoop. And today we're here with Madam Saito, the queen of sushi, and we're here for the 2015 Subaru Cherry Blossom Festival, which is a great celebration that goes on in Philadelphia to promote the Japanese culture. And a part of that celebration, Madam Saito is um, doing a sushi class, and everybody here is participating. And bunch of amateurs that maybe want to do sushi for dinner parties, um, maybe personal like culinary skills or things like that. So, Madam Saito, thank you for having us. Thank you very much for everyone and thank you for your guys coming. I love everyone, love to do sushi. Can I tell my students, introduce a little bit? All right, well, everybody seems to be kind of mingling and, and whatnot, but um, I guess, how did you guys feel about the class here today? It's awesome. It's great. Yeah. Did you guys learn a lot? Yeah. And what are you guys going to be using these new found skills for? Make sushi at home. Yes. Dinner parties? Yeah. Excellent, see? So if you missed it, do you have another opportunity to come back? Monsaito does do uh, sushi classes. Now, tell us, tell us a little bit about yourself. Like, when did you get started in uh, making sushi? Yes, I started to make sushi when I was little. And I prepare from Tokyo in Japan to this country that I can teach sushi for everyone. And I heard somewhere you've been doing it for about 21 years or something to that effect. And also you, more than that? 27 years. 27 years. In this location. That is a lot of uh, rolling, a lot of, she's a probably should have heard a sushi platinum rapper. Yes, a lot of people. <laughs> and I training a lot of chefs too. Excellent. Excellent. And tell us more about your restaurant. My restaurant, yes, I love it here. Everyone special loves sushi. And then I prepare more new food now for izakaya. It means appetizers for a lot of different plate dishes for a customer who come just get one beer and one appetizer. Nice. And um, if you had to give any kind of advice to anybody that might be looking at, you know, uh, roll their own sushi and maybe practice at home and whatnot. What kind of advice would you give them? Yes, I usually advise that everyone, when you have a party, to make sushi. And that is the most important. And if you have a question, just call me. There you have it. And um, you also have a competition coming up for um, an amateur competition. I think it's Sunday. Can you tell us a little about that? Yes, I have every year two competitions. The first one at the head house to select all the good contestants to be in the Subaru uh, Sun Sakura Sunday for competition for Samurai of the Year 2015. Excellent. And um, if you again, if you haven't already been informed, the 2015 Cherry Blossom uh, Festival, uh, sponsored by Subaru, is going on in Philadelphia. There's plenty of activities. You can check our website. You can go online um, at SubaruCherryBlossom.org and see what's going on. Again, uh, the the cap is uh, the final festival is this coming Sunday, and there's going to be uh, food festivals. Uh, all types of activities, bring out the family, bring out the kids. Um, if you just love uh, to be uh, in the Japanese culture, there's one culture, learn something new, different, the weather's beautiful, so definitely come out, take advantage, and, and say hello to Ms. Saito when she's there, she can probably give you a couple pointers. Yes, so please don't forget to visit me for the sushi contest in uh, Sakura Sunday, and welcome to see my students create great, great sushi. Excellent. Well, there you have it, folks. Again, my name is Hector with WaterIce.com. Your scoops to everything Philly.